guys, I'm back with a review. Uh, I ha I have booted this OS and now I'm gonna log in to my account with the genome as my uh, user interface. You get three options here. You, uh, you get the system default. You get the genome classic. You get genome. Uh, let's get logged in. <coughs> Now we are here logged in in my account and uh, the things are getting loaded up okay so we have loaded up the system uh, we get a old fedora type look here and uh, <coughs> sorry uh, you get a bunch of applications here uh, let's take a look at the terminal is pretty low and uh, I think it's because just uh, we haven't uh, installed the applications uh, let's take a look at the uh, applications also uh, you get a bunch of applications here to choose from uh, in accessories you get these applications uh, in games you get these games uh, baby games Let's take a look at the system here, system settings. This might be because we haven't downloaded that things when we was we were installing the OS. So I think that might be the problem. The system application are not loading up. Or uh, no, we have loaded up the uh, system settings. Sorry, my bad. Okay, so we are here uh, using the Genome 3.4.2. Uh, it is an old version of Genome 3.2. 3.10 is out with Fedora 20, and I'm currently using it uh, on my as a host OS. So we get a bunch of updates here. Okay. So uh, I'll install them later on. 73.7 MB. It's quite a, a large amount of files here. Yeah. So I'll install it later on. Uh, here are the default applications here for the music video, photos, calendar, mail, web. Uh, for the graphics, we get the Chromium. Not. I'll leave it. Fuck it. I'm confused. Okay, so uh, we get a file manager here, uh, which is just the same UI, and not made uh, very much changes here. And uh, let's take a look at the lock screen. Uh, and this is the default lock screen. You know, you guys all know all know about it. And uh, uh, everything is same. Uh, so there is not much any difference. Uh, it is just similar to Fedora uh, 17 and 18, both combined. And uh, it's okay. So I guess it is this. Uh, we just get these uh, these bunch of applications. This type of UI which is primarily old and you can uh, check out Fedora 20 if you want uh, just for a daily usage uh, Fedora 20 is good, I've been using it for a quite uh, long time it's been almost 4 months since it's released that I've been using it and uh, I guess it's time to power off the virtual machine Oh yeah guys, uh, if you have any queries regarding this OS, uh, if you want me to do a review of any particular OS or something, you can drop a comment at the comment section below. And uh, uh, if you want my, if you like my videos, if you want me to do more, so I'll be doing more videos. Uh, I just need a support. Just hit the like button, so I keep getting support from you guys. Thanks for supporting.
Bye.